Hello, everyone. How's it going? Dr. Incompetent here, and let's resume our complete beginner's guide to Dwarf Fortress, shall we? Well, I got a good tip. I reassigned my pasture to get it out of the way from over here because of the wall. And I can click on uh, zones to find the pasture. It's right here. But the problem is I forgot to assign the animals to it. And because of that, all of the animals go to the meeting place, which is designated right now as our dining area, and they're not eating food. That's why the yak died. So I need to select basically all of them and just be like, look, except for the hunting dog uh, who's chained up, I want them all to kind of go in here. So I'm just going to tell all the animals, hey, please, you know, this is your place. Roll in there. And there we go. Okay, so that much is done. So if I click on... Uh, zones and I click on this and I select the animals you'll see that they're all there okay perfect now another tip that I got and I want to explore this which is that you know how I'm just like mining out and wherever I find gems so for example right here let's say I want this tetrahedrite I could push M to do regular mining but you see this like arrow right here this right arrow uh, you can either push N or you can just click on it and it's advanced options. And right now I'm just mining everything. But what if I say dig only ore and gems selected and auto mine any ore and gems of the same type which are uncovered. You can also change the priority. Remember how I'm like, um, t like boxing people off by erasing certain areas? You can just crank up the priority if you plan out a lot of mining so that they will uh, dig that for you. But let's just practice with this auto mining. So I'm just going to be like auto mine this, like this. And you'll notice how, look, they don't even, the clay, they're not doing it. They're only doing gems. And if they find more gems or ore, they'll go right for that. So thank you so much, everyone. I really love that everyone is helping out in the YouTube comments and uh, explaining some of the Steam features to me as an older player uh, that are just so fantastic. So here's Limonite, for example. Uh, and if I just go to this, it's iron. So I can go back to M and I can just do auto mine right here as well, like this whole cavern. And then look at that. So once I kind of dig out an outline, um, I can just use auto mining on around any kind of area where there might be gems. And they'll go for it. Now they can't get these because these are at the edge of the map. But that's just fantastic. I'm going to push escape and I'm going to unpause the game. We also just got some migrants. Uh, so let's kind of um, zoom in to where they are. And they must have already moved in. Hopefully. So we have... Uh, How's this dog doing? Injured. Caught in the rain. Soon you won't be caught in the rain. They're going to finish these, um, this ceiling. Look at that. There they go. Do it. There will be no rain for you anymore, dog. So soon. You're going to be thrilled. Um, all of these trees, I'm going to chop them down. Let's just get all these trees out of the way. Even the trees above our base, now that we're getting this wall, we should be okay. Now, you notice how they haven't, they're not doing the wall. And this is because I tr I wanted to, just for aesthetic purposes, make it all out of the same uh, material. But by doing that, you know, this is claystone. Now, nah, there's plenty of claystone. I thought maybe sometimes they'll run out if you try to select it. And they'll be like, I can't get it. Um, but no, nah, they got it. They'll figure this out. Okay, great. We're up to 300 drink. Uh, we're doing very, very well on most things. Let's see. Um, a master cabinet. Uh, a puppy. So I'm just going to clear some of these. We struck a bunch of cool stuff. Great. I'm going to pause it and just take a look at what we're doing. So we've got our cool temple. It's all engraved. This stockpile, by the way, this furniture stockpile is insanely full. Here's our dormitory. Here's our farming level, and we could, uh, not all of the fields are planted, so I'm not in a big rush, but I am going to go ahead and just mine, and I'm not doing auto mine, I'm just doing all mining, because I want to just kind of finish this hallway over here, get it part of the main area, 
finish the stairs. We are getting uh, cages filled in here, which is great. And this furniture stockpile is getting filled up. You can see that they've started bringing the stuff in that we want. And this is a metalsmith forge. And this is the wood furnace so we could, you know, make charcoal if we want. And we might want it. And then this is, um, let's see, how are our orders doing for hatch covers are getting made. Rock mugs are getting made. Mechanisms are getting made. Let's see if I can add that order for uh, coke. Either one, lignite or bituminous coal. And I'm just going to say, so we're going to make this as long as coke is less than 10. That's great. And I don't need to, I'm not going to set anything else either for this. Um, okay, that's good. And let me go back to this. New order. So we're already making coke from bituminous coal, but uh, let's also make coke from lignite, and we'll put the same, um, either way, like with this proviso on there too. Now we might need to tweak this if these aren't working, but what this will do is just make sure that that's in the pipeline. And uh, we completed cut gems. Encrust finished goods with cut gems, 50. And let me look at, you know, the rest of these. Um, if, so they'll restart it completed. Um, they'll restart it if it meets the conditions, which it will. And they'll just do it tomorrow. So they'll restart that tomorrow. So that's fine. Okay. So uh, they're going to be mining this out eventually. You know one thing I'd like? Because I have a lot of mining projects. And usually I like to have specialists everywhere. But for mining, I'm not too concerned about it. Um, even if basically all that happens is with mining is I'm just going to click P for stockpile. I'm going to click on this and I'm going to uh, repaint it just doing it's going to box that out, include the entire thing. And um, I'm going to make a lot of people be miners. They'll just be slower at it and that's fine. So we're just going to go doors and hatches and we're just going to say door. And I am going to just, um, oops, uh, build doors and hatches, door, um, use closest material and let's just make some doors again I just like doors okay just gonna throw some doors around here give people some jobs oh that's looking good got all the hatches up there Door right there. A door right there. Boy, that stockpile is insane. You know, uh, I could just make this larger. No real reason not to. I'm not doing anything else here. I could also, if I wanted to, make this temple kick out a little bit more over here. And I will. Okay. So they did finish the roof over the dog, so the dog will never be in the rain. So, you know, hopefully it's okay. It's a sickly injured dog, which is not ideal. So what do we do about that? Well, it reminds us that there's still a lot that needs to be done. So this is our second floor. And uh, because we're so close to the surface on this floor, we have this loam floor that we can turn into farm plot and we might need that so what i'm going to do is i'm also going to mine out a pretty massive chunk right here put a door here put a door here like that 
for the door here. Now, speaking of mining, I'm just talking about this, but I doubt anyone's actually going to be. Here's the smelter. These jobs are there. Maybe somebody's working on it. What are you doing? Oh, are they doing it? Yeah, they're making coke from bituminous coal. So somebody is doing the job. Now, you'll right away see that um, this stockpile, um, we need to start getting some more wheelbarrows going. We don't have enough so that people can move big rocks around easier. Like, there is a wheelbarrow up here, but we could use some more. How many have I made? No, I don't have any. We're going to add a job. Um, and we don't need an adamantine. That's awesome, though. Uh, give me a wooden one. Wooden wheelbarrows. And we're going to say... Amount of empty wheelbarrows is less than 10. And... Amount of wheelbarrows available... Less than 20. Less than 20. Okay. Because I want wheelbarrows. Makes life easier. All right, good. They got wheelbarrows going. Love to see it. Now, I, I'm going to go over here. And I want, this is like... I just want them to make something really simple. Which is... This is the Metalsmith's Forge. Okay. Now... What if I want... No, that's instruments. That's good. Traps, other objects, right? And what, like, what if we wanted steel and minecarts, bracelets, crafts, tools? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. I'd kind of like to have some more mining picks. So, it seems good. We have the anvil there. It came with us. Hmm. Let me see where I can find that. What if I have a new job for... Yeah, here we go. So, just forge me a pick. Now, iron seems pretty easy. Now, I don't need that many. I think five will be good. But I'm going to, like, put this way up on the priority. And see if anybody can actually do this. We need iron to do it. Like, iron bars, most likely. But... We have found, okay, so, uh, let's see, where did I put this stuff? Down here, didn't we find microline? No, 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 no. Tourmalines, limonite, here we go. So we could use limonite to make iron bars. Now, I'm curious to see, I can't remember if somebody can jump ahead that far to make these picks that we need or if what has to happen is basically I have to make the bars first. I don't know if they could be like, okay, I want to make the pick, so I need to go get the bar. So I'll go smelt and I'll make some iron, right? I mean, that would be good. I could make clay crafts if I wanted. And I guess we're making coke. Look, we have a bunch here, actually. Good. All right. Now, let me go to... Where's the floor with the farm? Let me find it. Right here. Okay, they finished digging this room out. Great. I'm going to pause it. So this room is just wide open. 
has some gypsum and lignite. Great. So we can use that for our coke. I'm going to go to build and I'm going to go to um, workshops and I'm going to go into. Hmm. Let me see if I can recall where this is actually located. We m we'll need an ashery at some point. Yeah, maybe a Craftsdorf shop is what we could use that for, but clothing and leather, loom. Yeah, we might need the loom. So, you know, one of the things that we would want is to make some medical facilities of some kind to perhaps treat things. Uh, oh, this guy got struck by melancholy. That's a shame. Um, blissful, blissful. Everything was happy. And all of a sudden, melancholy. No job. Well, you'll get something to do eventually. Now, this stockpile, we're just going to click on it. We're going to repaint it. And we're going to include all of this. And then this zone here, we're going to repaint it to include this new room actually this new well no all of this there you go except and then what we're going to do is we are going to uh set this here for smoothing and unpause it so we're going to get this temp like we're going to get this whole temple even fancier and better for everyone which is key okay so Hatches are coming in. The dog... Yep, is under the roof. The wall... Yeah. Not happening in the way that we want. But it's, you know, eventually. It'll get there. And then... This is getting smooth. They are using this extra space for the stockpile. We'll build something new here, but notice there's no place for us to put any further farm plots. Which I was curious about. Well, I just got my answer up here. You see that uh, they canceled all the jobs to make a pick. Um, and now, unfortunately, our leather worker has also gone insane. So that's a problem. So what we're going to need to do is deal with our leather worker who is uh, insane. So uh, they're stricken by melancholy and uh, we're in bad shape. So we might need to put this person in jail. It's possible. We might have to fight them to the death. I hope not. But we can't make anything until we get bars. So what we're going to need to do is um, go here and just add a task for iron bars. And just kind of any... Um, Iron bar, let's see, iron, we need, well, that's not it. Uh, make pig iron bars requires iron bars. Uh, that doesn't seem good. Let's smell ore. That has iron in it, right? So, uh, this tetrahedrite should do it. I think. Let me go double check that. It's going to take me a second to get this back online. Microline. Yeah. Okay, limonite will work for iron. Uh, 
Um, and so will hematite. Let me see here. Yeah, laminite and hematite will also work. So let's do this and let's also do this and then we can just say, um, you know, do these tasks indefinitely. But we're going to need another smelter because we're using one smelter for coke all the time. Uh, let's go ahead and build ourselves a... Do, 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 do. Smelter. And we'll just drop it here. Great. Okay. So, uh, we can turn this area right here, if we want, into a hospital. So we can build some beds to be like hospital beds. Um, but build furniture bed. Use the closest. Like that. We'll just have eight for now. Pretty good. And then... Um, if I want to make an area that's going to be um, a hospital. You get a meeting area, and then you select this whole zone, and then you say accept, and then we can add, like if we wanted it to be a hospital, we need a chief medical dwarf, okay? And then um, if we click on the zone itself, We're going to need tables, traction benches, storage containers. And let's go ahead then and assign a chief medical dwarf. So we're going to go over here and we're going to click on this. And this dude is actually good, expert diagnostician. So you get it. You just got the job. Um, and let me find... Um, this guy uh, let's see where's my chief medical dwarf nobles no this guy Doran okay you where's Doran Doran where'd you go here he is um, no, that's a different door, and I think. Well, maybe it's not. All right. I'm going to go down. I'm going to give some time. Just let, let some time sink in here. And, yep. They can't make the pick because they need iron bars. We got that much. Then. I need to build furniture. We need to put some doors on. And then I'm going to build uh, furniture. We can build some tables. Build furniture. Traction bench. We don't actually have any. I'll have to make some. But we can build um, cabinets in this place to store stuff. And then we can also build some chests just in case. Whatever you need. I'm going to go to orders. And, well, we don't need to go to orders. Let's just go to a carpenter's place and say, uh, here, make me a traction bench. Hmm. I guess that's not there. Yeah. 
Is it here? Hmm. Oh gosh, is it like in mechanics or like siege? Let me see. Yep, traction bench. It's the mechanics workshop. I'm just going to make four. Get those in. All right, there they go. And then let me check the, the chief medical dwarf. Like, do you need anything? Oh, you can give them a gift or something. Um, anyway, that's pretty funny. Are you my dude? No official position. You're not the right guy. Here he is. Perfect. Okay, so what I want to do is I want to go to his room and go to his quarters, and we need to just build uh, a table and uh, a chair in here. And then create an office right here that's for him. All right. Now, one thing I always like to do in the hospital area is make it really nice. So we can go to smoothing and we can just smooth the entire thing. When dwarves are recovering, it's got to be top shelf. So this will be a place for dwarves to recover if they get injured. And we do want to keep our eyeballs on um, the insane individual. Yeah, they're miserable. So we might have to get a sheriff going to deal with the uh, dwarf that has gone melancholy because the strange mood, they couldn't satisfy whatever they wanted to do. So they needed, they wanted to build something or make something, but we didn't have the item is how this usually goes. And so they've become sad and then gone insane. And before they become hostile, we can appoint a sheriff um, and we don't have anybody that has relevant skills, sadly, but I'm going to do it anyway. Now, a sheriff needs a lot. Um, they need their own dining room. Uh, they need, oh boy, they need a, an office. They need a better bedroom. They need, oh boy. Um, we're just going to leave that vacant for now. So, uh, that might be our next job, is to deal with getting a sheriff set. We're building a, a, a hospital right here and uh, we are working on everything installing that. We've built the roof over here. We have talked about auto mining and we're getting gems. Our value is you know skyrocketing for what we can sell. We are trying to get to uh, you know making some bars but it's going to take us a second to get that operation going so we can make some more picks. And I, I feel like I'm misremembering. I think iron is more complicated than I want it to be. And I might need to use a different um, metal to do this, but we'll see. And we are making more wheelbarrows, mercifully. So I think uh, we're just making some great progress here. I want this wall to continue. We probably need to build some more traps to make ourselves safe for now. We've got a great start. Everyone, I hope you're still finding this series to be useful and fun. We've got a lot of work to do, but that's part of the fun. Thank you so much. Take care.